O oh God, you are my God. Early will I seek you. My soul thirsts for you. My flesh longs for you in a dry and thirsty land where no water is. To see your power and your glory so as I have seen you in the sanctuary. Because your loving kindness is better than life, my lips shall praise you. Thus will I bless you while I live. I will lift up my hands in your name. My soul shall be satisfied as with marrow and fatness. And my mouth shall praise you with joyful lips. When I remember you upon my bed and meditate on you in the night watches, because you have been my help, therefore in the shadow of your wings will I rejoice. My soul follows hard after you. Your right hand upholds me, but those who seek my soul to destroy it shall go into the lower parts of the earth. They shall fall by the sword. They shall be a portion for foxes, but the kings shall rejoice in God. Everyone who swears by him shall glory, but the mouth of them who speak lies shall be stopped. Yesterday, I was speaking with a friend of mine, and we both felt something, and she uttered it first, and I confirmed know about you but have you been feeling of late that there's something going on in the atmosphere in the spiritual realm we might not be able to put our fingers on it but something is going on there's something happening something is brewing and in some instances has already been launched in the realm of the spirit do you not discern it All these spontaneous attacks, attacks at schools, attacks at spontaneous spots, all these breakouts, they're causing persons to think twice about where they go, when they go, and with whom they go. There is a spirit of fear that has already been released on a whole nother level in the earth realm. Spontaneous acts of brutality, spontaneous acts of violence, spontaneous massacre, spontaneous things are happening. We both agreed that surely we are in the last days. This is end time. It's end time. And safety is guaranteed only through Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Before you go to work, you gotta pray. Before you pick up the child, you gotta pray. While the child is in school, you gotta pray. Matariashata. Dalushkatabandorokoshiantata. Before you go to church, you gotta pray. Before you leave, you got to pray. Before you enter your vehicle, you got to pray. Before you exit, you got to pray. While you're on the street, you got to pray. Before you go to the store, you got to pray. While you are in the store, you got to pray. Nowhere is safe anymore, it seems. The kingdom of darkness is on a mission. The satanic kingdom recognizes that the hour is upon us. The satanic kingdom recognizes that time is going and time is running out. They're trying to get as many persons recruited as many persons into their kingdom as possible. There is a serious war going on. And the war has intensified in the spiritual realm. These pockets of shootings that are happening here, there, and everywhere. 
they are signs before our eyes of the aggressive nature with which the enemy is opposing the kingdom of light. They herald the last days the end time move. And even as God has an end time move, the satanic kingdom has an end time move too. And so this morning, because we feel like there's something going on, there's something. In fact, because of what I'm discerning, I, I would say to someone just now, you got to be extremely careful of where you are right now. In these days, you have to be very deliberate about your location. You have to be very intentional about where you are at any given point in time. Make sure you are where God wants you to be. Not where man wants you to be. But where God wants you to be right now. Anything can happen. I'm feeling very strongly in my spirit. That sudden casualties are going to get even worse. Sudden casualties. Sudden. And casualties do not only speak of violent events where man is concerned. Not only that. But just the other day, I remember I had the same dream twice. Glory to God. I dreamed that everything was just normal. And then all of a sudden, it's like there was this shift. There was this major devastation. And the first time I saw the devastation, it occurred in the form of me. It's like I was in this vision because this happened in the early morning. And I feel like I transitioned from dream, from dreaming to having a vision. I just saw myself looking and there appeared before me something like a circle. And I was able to look through the circle. It's like the circle was like a window. And I was able to peek and see what was going on beyond. And as I looked, okay, I saw the light, sunlight. It was day. I saw trees and everything. And in a matter of seconds, as the Lord allowed me to look through this hole or this window that was circular, all of a sudden there came this huge wind. And before I know it, there was this storm. And I'm telling you, there was absolutely no sign whatsoever that there was a storm coming. When I looked through the window at the first, as I said, it was just sunlight. A typical day of summer. There was no overcast cloud, nothing. Everything was fine and bright. And all of a sudden, I just saw this storm. It just changed sh suddenly. Clouds changed. Everything changed. Rain, thunder, storm. And I was taken out of the vision. Then last week, I had a similar vision, but this time it wasn't a storm. Everything was going normally. Things were happening typically. And all of a sudden, I saw a tornado. I've never witnessed a tornado in my whole life, for real, like in real time. I've only seen it on TV, never experienced it. But I saw a tornado, in fact, two, two tornadoes. Suddenly there was this cry. And there was no way anyone could have predicted them. There was no way they could have been forecast. No way. Things were just happening as usual. Things were looking normal. They just suddenly appeared out of nowhere. 
And I heard deep in my spirit, first of all, the word of God tells us, even according to Joseph's interpretation of Pharaoh's dream, he said, behold, you have gotten the same dream twice because the Lord was showing you that the thing is already established. It will happen. It will come to pass. And that is why you got the same dream two times. And so I feel very strongly that this is not a question. It's not a if, it's not a but, it's not a maybe, but sudden casualties are upon us. Sudden casualties. They will not just take the form of nature or weather events, weather patterns. But look out for patterns in other areas where we cannot predict their manifestation. We're in a time where the satanic kingdom is so desperate for souls, so desperate for growth and expansion. As we near the end, that they are doing just about anything. They're going just about anywhere. The only security that we have, true security in these days or in this time, is the blood of Jesus Christ. In your walking walk under the blood of Jesus, in your talking talk under the blood of Jesus, in your working work under the blood of Jesus Christ, in your shopping shop under the blood of Jesus Christ, in your sweeping and mopping mop under the blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. There is something going on. And this will result in spontaneous, sporadic, sudden fatalities. Sudden casualties. Sudden. These are things that the meteorologists will not be able to predict. These are things that the scientists, the most smart individuals or the smartest individuals, they'll, they'll not see coming. And so your protection, our protection, is being under the blood of Jesus Christ. Under the blood. Someone say, Lord, hide me under the blood. Hide me under your blood, Lord Jesus. Hide my children under the blood of Jesus. Hide my husband under the blood of Jesus Christ. Hide my sister. Hide my brother under the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah, let's pray. Karo shatata. Nana na sukatai. Doku shatai. Diriata manio shatai. Derio shatababa satai. Radio takantanus katatata. Jeli katiendo sarabai. Lebio tata. Rikata, open up your mouth right where you are. As we pray to our Father, from my house to your house, from house to house, we are connecting in prayer. I will not be your next victim, Satan. My child will not be your next victim. My family will not be your next victim. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We come together as an army in the realm of the spirit right now. We join hands right now as an army i just want even one or two persons 
to stand in agreement with me. There are some persons who will join and they'll just watch. At this moment, I'm not asking for watchers. I'm not asking for persons to spectate at this moment. I want some persons who understand what I've spoken about, what I'm talking about. That thing that is brewing in the realm of the spirit. Hallelujah. By the satanic kingdom. Hallelujah. The Lord says, call upon me and I will answer. He he said he is a present help in times of trouble. Present he is. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Shekutaba sata. Minkuntie nourishiatata. He said, Behold, I've given you, you the authority. And if we have authority, we're going to use it. Are you ready to pray with me? If you're on the job, I'm going to ask you, pray your warrior, to just take five minutes. Can you step away from the desk for five minutes? If you're driving, can you pull over for five minutes if you're not on the expressway or the highway, please? Perhaps this five minutes of prayer could save the life of a loved one perhaps these five minutes of prayer could intercept something that the enemy has cooked up for you five minutes glory to your name god el sharia we worship you Nato Rabaha, you are almighty God. El Sharia, we are seeking your attention this morning. El Sharia, if you're not too busy, which we hope you are not, we are looking for your face this morning and not your back. El Sharia, we're asking that you open up your ears to our petitions this morning. El Sharia, we want to make an urgent appeal to you. And we want to make it in the name of your son, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. El Sharia, we approach your throne to make a case and an appeal. In the blood of Jesus. The blood is all over us God. As your high priest of today. We come into the holy of holies with the blood. Evidence oh God that we have been washed. Evidence oh God that we have been sanctified. The law could not sanctify us. The law could not cleanse us. The law could make no good for us. But sanctification came through one blood. Not the blood of the kid. Not the blood of the ox. Not the blood of the sheep of Israel. But by the blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. The blood of Jesus that fell, that same blood that was seen on Calvary, on Calvary's cross. The same blood that when it dripped, when it touched the earth, after he gave up the ghost. That same blood that caused the saints of old to come out of paradise and to be seen or witnessed by persons in Jerusalem. The same blood that when it hit the ground, it caused an immediate response in the tabernacle. 
The veil of the temple was rent in twain. The same blood from which emanated power. Menon shatata. We come clothed in the blood. Wrapped up, tangled up in the blood of Jesus. He is our access to you, Father. So we know you will not hear us. If we come on our own accord, we know you will not hear us. And might not consider the urgency with which we have come. Except we come to you in the name of your son. In fact, your word did say that no man comes to you except through him. I am the way, the truth, and the life, he said. So he is the way to you. He is the path to you. The way is not something that was constructed. The way cannot be mapped. The way does not have north and south poles. The way does not operate with coordinate points. The way is a person. Today we appreciate the person and come to you in his name. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. <laughs> we locate right now. The satanic operation that is occurring globally. The satanic operation that is intended to cause global chaos, global catastrophe. Matamuskaya. We locate in the realm of the spirit, the very root, the very foundation of the satanic operation. That is intended to cause persons all over to be affected. We might not know when. We might not know how. But we know there is an operation. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth our Lord. As the saints we unify in and through prayer right now. We draw out the sword right now. Hallelujah. We put our hands on rocks right now in the spirit. We put our hands on hammers right now in the realm of the spirit. We put our hands on unusual devices and ammunitions in the realm of the spirit. We come against every satanic operation that has embedded or knitted within mass death mass calamities in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth we overturn those satanic edicts we overturn those satanic sanctions right now we locate them we locate signed documents we locate signed orders. We locate signed clauses and legislations. We locate signed laws. Metos hapushkatataya. We address the political team in the satanic kingdom. We address the governor of our countries in the satanic kingdom. We locate in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. The satanic law enforcement officers who are working behind the scene to push his agenda in the latter days. Father, in the name of your son, Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We command brimstone. We command rocks. We command heavy devices to begin to fall into those operations. We command satanic ammunitions to deplete. We command satanic oh, ghouls, satanic irons, satanic brass to begin to melt by fire in the name of
name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh, glory to your name. We locate in the name of Jesus Christ the satanic high places that were erected. To fight against the church, to fight against the people of God and the potential souls of, of God. We visit every high place and we go under every green tree in the realm of the spirit. Where these satanic altars have been built. Where these satanic meeting points have been built. Where these points of worship to Satan have been established. We locate them in the name of Jesus Christ. And we command immediate desecration of those high places by the blood of Jesus Christ. We locate the spots where blood has been shed. In exchange for the life of the innocent. In exchange for the life of the saints. Whatever the satanic kingdom is requiring as a result of some shed blood, we rip those things out of your hands and pull them far from your reach. You shall not attain them in the name of Jesus. Menusata. Delushkataya Bukushata. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We mash up the altars. We destroy the altars. Where the names of our family members were pronounced. We destroy the altars. Where our ministries were called. Yekotoma. We locate the altars where the mass destructive plan was established, signed on, designed, and was the starting point of its ex execution in the name of Jesus. We roar against those altars. We give a counter roar, Kata, in the realm of the spirit. Where those evil altars have been erected in the name of Jesus Christ. I am the righteousness of God. There is judgment in my mouth. He Kata Rababa Shanerebosa. Though the weapons be formed, they shall not prosper. We release Isaiah 7 verse 7 over those evil altars. Whatever you have planted there, whatever your blood rituals have started there, Satan, and I know you can hear, they shall not stand, neither shall they come to pass. We break your evil devices. We break your evil scepters. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We break your weapons into pieces right now. We bend your sword by the strength of the Lord right now. We wage war against you. We are not afraid of you. We release confusion in the midst of your army right now. Mendo Shata. We command that things become missing suddenly in the midst of your army right now. We command that they'll see each other as enemies so they'll begin to fight against each other instead of us right now in the name of Jesus. Let there be chaos. Let there be divide. Where their counsels are concerned in the name of Jesus. We push back every force 
We push back every agenda. We push you back. You will not come to my home. You will not come into my territory. You will not in the name of Jesus. We push you back. Territorial spirits we bind you. Territorial strong man we locate you. We bind you. Municipal demons we bind. National demons we bind. Continental demons we bind. Regional demons we bind. Shekutu mantata. We cripple you right now. In the name of Jesus. We stymie your operation right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. We locate brooms. We locate whatever they're using to fly. We render every device of assistance. And every means of transportation. Being used by the satanic elements. To cause chaos. To cause devastation. We render them powerless right now. The word of God says. He who dwells in the secret place of the most high shall abide under the shadow of the almighty. It talks about the arrow that flieth by day. And by night. We roar against every day like arrow. We release a cease and desist order in the heavens right now. We command an immediate diversion in the realm of the spirit. Begin to bounce back. Arrows coming from the north, the south, the east, the west. Bounce back. Arrows of murder begin to bounce back. In the name of Jesus. Arrows of massacre. We bend you and turn your back. In the name of Jesus. Arrows of sicknesses. Begin to turn back. Ricochet in the name of Jesus Christ. We cry aloud against arrows. We cry aloud against ammunition. We counter satanic attacks. We oppose satanic operations. We push them back. Shatari kano satabai. Du kanu shatiendo roboko Plead our cause, O oh God. Strive with us. Fight against those who fight against us. Take hold of shield and buckler. And stand up for our help. Say unto our souls, I am thy salvation. The great I am that I am. Defend the cause of your people. The great I am that I am. We beseech you for help. The great I am that I am. The one who judges in righteousness. Our just God who said. If we come to you and confess of our sins. You are faithful and just to forgive and to cleanse. Jehovah Mekodeshkem come in our midst. Hallelujah El Kibur come in our midst. Jehovah Sabaoth come in our midst. Come in our midst. We ordain punishment for the satanic camp or host that is up against us. We ordain punishment in the name of Jesus Christ. Let everything that exalts itself against the knowledge and wisdom of God be utterly punished in this hour in the name of Jesus. We stall every evil activity in our midst right now. 
We stall every evil meeting that is keeping in our communities, every evil meeting that is keeping in our territory. We stall them right now. In the name of Jesus Christ, we bring to naught. We bring to naught every agreement. We bring to naught every affidavit. We bring you to naught. Instructions, rituals being done. In the name of Jesus Christ, we mash up every plan of the enemy. We root out every evil that is being planted in our midst. We root you out. We root you out. We stand here in the spirit of Jeremiah. And we root out every evil in our territory. We take full dominion and authority over our territory. You will not capture us like Ziklag. You will not take our babies. You will not take our families. And so we uproot. We uproot. Not only do we uproot, but we destroy whatever came out the ground. We punish every devil on assignment right now. Let the angels of the Lord begin to chase them, Lord. Let the angels of Jehovah begin to persecute them who seek our hurt. Who have gathered against us let them begin to run for their lives oh you katu frabrushkata you can tu muskatu ribiatata we call forth divine order in the realm of the spirit right now you said in your word God that when we pass through the waters you will be with us and through the rivers they will not sweep over us when we walk through the fire we shall not be burned the flames shall not kindle upon us. They call see bandi shata. Lekatuman darakasata. We intercept every device and every operation aiming toward us, toward our lives, toward the lives of our family members. Wherever you are, by fire, by prayer, we locate you. We break you into pieces right now. We break every staff of the enemy into pieces right now. We break every sector into pieces right now. Every javelin we break. Every arrow we break. Every knife we break. Every missile we break. Every bomb we destroy. Keto manta varush kata in ketu ribiakasa. Rekanusa. Jesus. Let our way be clear. Let our path be free from obstruction. Let your glory be so heavy upon us, God. That when we move into territories, demonic spirits will hear of our coming and flee before we arrive. Kandoshatata. 
Let the word go forth that your daughter is coming. Let the word go forth that your servant is coming. Tell them, touch not. Touch not your men servant. Touch not your woman servant. Touch not. Reba sataya me kunturi kata tata zakusha. We mash up every plan. Every plan. Seen and unseen. Every plan. Tangible and intangible. We mash up in the name of Jesus Christ. Mighty God. Mighty God. In this sweet hour of prayer, we release captives. Hallelujah. Those who have been captured already, but they don't even know. Those who have been entrapped already in the spirit, but they don't even know. Those upon whose legs and feet are hooks, chains, they don't even know. Those who have been gripped in the waist and they don't even know. Those upon whose necks are some yokes and they don't even know. Satan in the name of Jesus Christ. It is written. He came to set the captives free. Shebanda raba satata. De lo shatama si koraba haya. Nanushkando rabo shatata. We command captives to be free. We find your lists. We command that you put us on your do not disturb list. Put us on your do not call list. Let our names go on that list. Do not call. Do not disturb. I desire that my name be placed on the top of that list. Do not call. Do not disturb. I desire that my children's names be placed on that list. We command freedom this morning. And we mash up, we destroy. We utterly destroy. We are bad apart. We are bad apart. Every destructive plan that is near us. Yea, though we walk through the valley of the shadow of death, we shall fear no evil. For thou art with us. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort us. Hallelujah. You are the lifter up of our heads. Oh, hallelujah. You are our light in darkness. Hallelujah. You are our sanity in the midst of madness. Oh, hallelujah. You are our joy in the midst of sorrow. Oh, hallelujah. 
<laughs> Jehovah, look at the plot. El Gibor, see the schemes. Look at them. See them out. Spot them out. Locate them by your power and your great wisdom. Our all-knowing God. Bring them to naught. Bring them to naught. Bring them to naught, Jehovah. And if it is indeed your will for these things that occur, hide us. Hide those who belong to us. Hide that which is ours. Under the blood of Jesus. Under the blood, the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Kana na 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 ta ta bande sha ta ta velish katendebe kerio nenushka. Praise flow from your belly. Let praise flow from your spirit. Begin to worship God. Begin to admire Him. Oh, exalt Him. Embrace Him. Caress Him. presence so strongly I feel his power so strongly with him I know I know I know it's holy the ground is holy <laughs> it's holy there is fire at this altar there is fire at the altar there is fire here, Kenu Shata. There is fire at the altar, Kanana Satata. There is fire here. We burn everything that came to destroy us. We burn Kanana Javo Kanana Sata Yaboka. Everything that was sent by Satan, every gift, kibu shata, we burn, kenana, zavushka, we refuse you and we burn you. Ekatora. 
No thanks to your gifts. We don't want anything you're giving to us. No sickness. Reba. Shatata. If you're giving us car, we don't want it. Next thing we meet in accidents, we don't want your gifts. Keto Rabo. Shatata. We don't want your evil anointing and authority. We will not pay no money to get any kind of validation or power from you. We don't want your masototobakata. We don't want you. We want nothing from you. Glory to your name. Arise in power, Lord. Arise in dominion, Lord. Arise in splendor, O oh Lord. Arise. Arise. Come on, get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Let Jehovah be glorified in our midst. We speak to the gates that are under the sound of our voices. Oh, lift up your head, O ye gate. And be ye lifted up, ye everlasting doors, so that the King of glory can come in. Is this king of glory <laughs> the Lord strong and mighty he is the king of glory lift up your head O ye gates and be ye lifted up ye everlasting doors so that the king of glory shall come in who is this king of glory he is the Lord of hosts begin to open up and allow his presence to come in begin to open up and allow his glory to infiltrate this room. Begin to open up. Make way for the king of glory. Make way for the Lord of hosts. Begin to open up. Take your rightful place right here God. Take your rightful place in this house God. Take your rightful place in my temple God. This body is yours, God. This body belongs to you, God. All of me belongs to you. All of me is yours, God. My hands are yours. My womb is yours. My belly is yours. My back is yours. My thighs are yours. All of me, all of me is yours, Lord. My eyes are yours. My ears are yours. I am all yours. So take your rightful place. Take your rightful place right now, Lord. We could go on and on and on. But I pray the Lord will have his way in your midst. Have your way, Lord. Have your way. Have your way, Lord. Have your way. Lord, have your way. Have your way. Hallelujah. Glory to God. God bless you everyone as you continue to be prayerful. As you continue to cry out to God at your altar. As you continue to harmonize with the prayers that have gone forth in this atmosphere. God bless you. God bless you. Hallelujah. People of God. As I speak here, I'm reminding those persons who are in Florida 
that we're going to have a grand time next week, Friday and Saturday, June 10 to 11, at the Fort Lauderdale Grand Hotel. I cannot wait by the mercies and grace of God to be in your midst. Many will be healed. So many will be delivered and we just can't wait. The book signing for my book, I've Seen Jesus Will Occur from 5 to about 6.45 p.m. and then at 7 o'clock we'll have the main worship experience and of course we will segue into healing and I can't wait. I can't wait. I just can't wait. I can't wait. Hallelujah. See you tomorrow, family, at 7.30 p.m. Jamaican time. God bless you right here. And of course, on my YouTube channel as well. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. I love you. God bless you. I truly love you. I truly love you. I do. I love you. Have a wonderful day, everyone. God bless you. Hallelujah.